I'll show you something. What are you gonna show me? Oh, hey, that's a fuse box from earlier. Can I look at the fuse box? Can I take a picture of the fuse box? No. Okay. Come on, this way. Are you gonna take me to the big fan? Oh, sorry, sir. Do not push me in this. I've analyzed the data and it seems like there's a significant surge of energy emulating from that area. If only I could find the source of it. But there's nothing in here, nothing your naked eye can see. But you have the camera. I see where this is going. You want me to go in there? It pains me to admit it, but I will need your help. Could you please? Yeah, I might as well. Splendid! If you find anything, please try to photograph it for me. Sure. Excellent. Please wait here for a moment so I can turn off the fan. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Basically is. Okay, why the hell not? Oh, I guess we're going in here. Oh, up. That's good, so up. Middle, no. Northeast, north. No, north, east, east, north. That's how I'm gonna remember that. I'm assuming that that's for his cabinet that I saw earlier. Junk, more junk, and pliers! There's nothing more I can use. Oh, I can use the pliers. There's nothing but junk in the drawer. There's something in there. I can feel it. Do not stick your hand in a grate. That's a bad idea. Like some pliers. Can't get a good grip on the screws. I'm going to need to find something else like an actual fucking screwdriver. Don't give me spooky noises. Don't give me spooky things like that. Okay, hey man. I saw the code for your like dresser thing. If you found the knob again. This is not where I wanted to go. Oh, you're not here now. That's great. I can't do anything with the electricity. Oh, maybe I can use the pliers to get the bottle. Which honestly wouldn't make very much sense. But I'm gonna try it anyway. Wait. Ha <laughs> ha! I fucking knew it! Knob. There we go. Joke's on you though. I already know I already know the answer. Got it. Drawer is now unlocked. Open it. What do we have here? A screwdriver. And then whatever that is, is probably going to let us get the bottle. And then the bottle is going to let us get into that door. That door is going to let us get something that's going to give us to the door or to the bottle. And then the bottle is going to give us something else. And I don't know what the bottle is going to give us. Come on. Get me in there. I don't like where I'm going. And I also would never crawl through the sewer, but done. It's not time to crawl in. Do not enjoy closed in spaces like this. Can I back it? Nope, I'm gonna have to go forwards. Oh, I do not like how this moves. Ugh. <laughs> Can I flash my light? It's pitch black. That's me for the better. Shit. Oh, hey. Another light sensor. I like how it fills up like liquid. Hey there, buddies. How you guys doing? That did the trick. What do we have here? Floppy disk. Well, I'm gonna put that into the TV. Not the TV. Hey, how are you? Get in that closet. Get in that closet. What the fuck is that thing? Oh, who goes there? What the? Why are you here? You can speak? I'm, s I'm sorry. I don't understand. Help me! I don't want to fucking help you. Huh? Y you're speaking in reverse? Yes. Uh, what do you want? I'm in pain. Aww. Please help me. Aww. Set me free. Yeah, man, what do you need? Can I- should I take a picture of you? Oh no, it's Q. Aw, I'm sorry, buddy.
That did the trick. The tumor's gone. It hurts. Aw, I'm sorry, I'm trying. I mean, you're not scary, I just feel bad for you. Make it stop. There we go, buddy. Is this gonna make you feel better? Do you feel better? What in the world is happening? Yeah, it's agreeable. What the hell? It's a mask from that poor thing. It seems different. The expression has changed into a more peaceful one. Oh yay, I helped it! I should take it to Riley. Hey Riley! I got some weird stuff for you to look at. This is your room? This is not your room. Hey Riley, I got the wrong door. Can I get into your computer first? No, I need to talk to you. Mask? You're back. Please, accept my apologies for my enthusiasm. What do you have here? Um, hey Riley, I found this mask. Mask, huh? There must be a story to it. My anticipation is killing me. Shit. You wouldn't believe what I saw. Let me explain it all to you. That is extraordinary! <laughs> the mask, the photos, and the creature? And you really let me borrow these for my studies? You're a lifesaver. Hey, that's cool. <laughs> I don't have any use for that stuff. I hope you don't find... I, uh, I hope you find them helpful. I'm sure I will. I think I'm going to check that- Ugh, Please don't check that place yourself! I just got out of there! It was bad! Maybe there's still something there. Yeah. Okay. Good luck, Riley. Okay, now I can get into your computer! Oh, looks like the father of my computer- your used like- Looks like the computer that my father used to have. I'm sure that's a floppy disk drive. I'll just insert the floppy disk and... There. What next? Eat a boot. Success! Reboot sequence. Success! Boot to power link 102. Success! Oh. Oh no. St what do you mean, status warning? Oh, I fucked up this guy's PC. He's gonna be mad. That did it. Some of the power is off now. Dude, I just fucked up this guy's PC. This dude's gonna be really fucking mad. How's he gonna get shit to fix it? He's in the sewer. He's in the sewer in an alternate dimension. This guy's never gonna be able to fix his shit. It's like that one um, Black Mirror episode. Was it Black Mirror? It, but basically this guy, he's just like, oh, I'm the last person on Earth. Well, at least I'm able to, like, read the books until the end of my life. And then he breaks his glasses. That's what this guy's going through. He's like, well, you know, I'm in a kind of hell dimension, but at least I got my PC to do my research. I fucked up his PC! <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> How are you? Are you following me? No, I... Uh, leave me be. Maybe I could help you. You can't help me. No one can. Why? Surely there's something I can do for you. You wouldn't understand. Try me. Please don't think of me. You need to let me vanish. Farewell. Hi. Kind of feel bad for him. Well, he doesn't want my help. There's nothing I can do. I know what I can do is I can steal this bug net and then I can get the bottle. Bug net my ass, this is a bottle net. Oh, another letter. Ah, uh, another note. Writing is the only thing that keeps me sane. Maybe that is what keeps me here. I need to stop writing and finally commit myself to silence, to blackness. But I'm scared of what would happen. That's so sad. I wish I could do something for him. Watch the good ending is gonna be that I actually just need to fucking ignore this guy. 
Hey, if I go back into your room, are you gonna yell at me for, okay, you're not gonna yell at me for turning off your PC. Can I follow you into the weird here and then see? I wanna talk to this guy one more time and see if he's gonna get pissed at me for breaking his computer. Now it's gonna hit me with a jump scare. I'm preparing myself beforehand so that this way I don't need to, when it actually happens, I'm not gonna be scared. Riley, are you in here? No, okay, I wasted my time, sorry. Alrighty then. I guess I'm gonna go fish out a bottle. Please don't go back into your computer room and don't try to turn on your computer because you're gonna be a little bit mad at me. Bug net. And now I smash the bottle. Because there's probably something inside. Let's see what's inside the bottle. Key card! What's this for? Well, it's gonna be for the weird ladder that I found. No, yes, yes. And... No buttons to be found. But there is a card reader! Hope this works. Whoa! Also, my man, you could definitely have jumped to grab that. It's time to get out of this place. I don't know what awaits me up there, but I'm drawn to the sunlight. It's only one way to find out. It's gonna be my dead father. Oh no, it's gonna be therapy. It must have felt liberating to get out of the sewers. Yeah, seeing the sunlight shining from above. And I could smell the scent of flowers, grass, and trees. I don't know what to expect, but it sure felt encouraging. Yes, I can imagine. I'm just so damn confused. A scientist talking about different forms of energy. See, I, I have zero knowledge about any of that. So how could my mind make up all of that? That is curious indeed. And that spider-like creature in the mask it wore. The hell? Unfortunately, I don't know what to tell you. You seem well aware of how the human mind works. It yields... It yields such power over us. Or maybe your experience was something more. In the end, we don't know much about the universe. Yeah, well said. I am inclined to believe that there is an explanation beyond logic. Maybe I'll make a fool out of myself. And this... At this point, I don't care. It's better to be open-minded. Yeah. You look eager to continue, unless I'm mistaken. You read me right. Oh, there's another one! I kind of thought this would be a four-act play. So, I climbed up the ladders. Fresh air! Finally! Huh? Where am I now? Who the fuck cares? At least I'm not in a sewer. Can I still take pictures? Yes, I can. Telephone? It's a telephone booth. I haven't seen one in a while. Such beautiful scenery. Oh. A welcome change for sure. Can I examine the garbage? Can I examine anything? No, okay. I know. See, that's what I mean. This game looks fucking beautiful. Gate. Won't budge. <laughs> I could climb over. It's a fucking fence! <laughs> Who gives a shit if it won't open? It's a fucking fence! <laughs> Saved the game. Mailbox? There's no mail. Door? Coffee mug? There's nothing I can use in the cupboard. Nope. Nope. Yes. There's no fire in the fireplace. That's a shame. I love the sound of fire and popping. Oh, resin! <laughs> the sensation of warmth emulating from fire is unique. Oh well. Ah oh, man, I climbed enough fences in my life. You could easily hop over something twice your size. Oh. Hello. Hi. I didn't hear you from the bathroom. I wasn't aware ghosts needed to use. Actually, never mind. Well then. I don't recognize your pretty face. And you're also carrying the camera. You must be our new guest. Any luck finding the portal object yet? Not yet, I'm afraid. Don't worry about it, dear. I'm sure it'll show up in no time. Mm. Oh, 
Where are my manners? Would you like to have a cup of tea? I'd prefer a cup of coffee if possible. Of course, dear. Please join me shortly, and the coffee should be ready. All right. Thanks. All right, bye, sir. Can I look at your ladder? No, wait. I kind of wanted to explore everything else there. Yeah, I could use a bath. I'm not going to use somebody else's bath. Dude, you need to clean up your attic. Oh, hey, another telephone. This is going to be great. I don't have anyone to call. Someone's going to call me, though. Camera? Camera! No more boards. Can I take the boards for firewood, though? And I can start a fire? Oh, don't be silly. I'm sure it's nothing. Damn you, woman. I'm telling you, something wicked is among us. <gasps> <laughs> Mind your tongue, rev oh, reverend. Please, accept my apologies. Would you please come with me? It'll be easier to show you. Of course. You should have asked me right away. What's up? I'm terribly sorry, dear. But the coffee must wait for a little longer. No problem. Who's this, then? Never mind, there's no time. Let's get going. Make you- maybe a little bit- maybe you can come with us. We could use your help repelling- ugh, repelling the evil. That's not a good sign. I don't want to help. Sure, it sounds like something I'd enjoy doing. Oh, that's great. Alright, is there any chance that this is gonna lead me to something- Oh, there's a lot of you guys! But nothing is blocking the gate. Neither it's locked. I don't understand. I'm afraid dark times are upon us. We're not allowed to enter the memorial site. We must repent. Let's calm down. There must be a logical explanation. Something maybe is blocking the gate from the other side. Maybe something my camera can see? I can sense the dark presence. Something like a camera should be able to pick up? I can feel some something tingling. Like tingling from a picture that just came out of a camera? It's the darkness. We must resist this- oh, seducing company? Repent! Could it really be something wicked? How strange. Maybe I could help. Huh? Could you drive the demon away? What a coincidence. Perhaps it is she who- I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda surprised to figure out that I'm supposed to be a woman. I just thought it was a guy with a ponytail. <laughs> That's enough, Reverend. Look at the kindness on her face. There's no way she has anything to do with any of this. You're likely right, as always, Miss uh, Aswin. <laughs> I'm sorry. I appreciate your apology. But what should we do? Somebody has to do something. I could everyone step back from the gate, please? I'll see what I can do. Our hero. Hip. <laughs> Hip. Hooray. <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, that definitely looks like a demon. What the hell? Hey, sorry guys, I kind of summoned a demon. I didn't really think this through. Oh no, I got rid of it. That's good. D demon? Intriguing how things have unfolded. What on earth was that? Are we safe? Reverend was right. Calm down, everyone. I can no longer sense the dark presence. Our new friend here succeeded in banishing the shadowy spirit. Does that mean we're safe? So it seems. Nothing like this has ever happened before. I wonder what brought the spirits here. Hmm, suddenly there's ghosts and some guy who can see ghosts, or I guess some girl who can see ghosts shows up. Mm, that's crazy. <laughs> so many questions, but no answers. It is time to put this strange and curious episode behind us. I invite you all, join me at the memorial site to rem reminisce about our loved ones. Oh yeah, this is definitely a game about grief. Yeah. Might as well join them. Now everyone's gonna get their own grave, right? What's up? Hi, Reverend. What is this place? This is our, memori our memorial site. In a way, it acts like a cemetery. But instead, we remember our living loved ones. So it's anti-cemetery? <laughs> Good one. I suppose you could put it that way. Yeah. 
Well, it's beautiful. Precisely. We can't feel much. Here, emotions seem to be more easily felt than expressed. I can believe that. It's so calm. I'm sorry for giving you such a hard time. It's clear that I don't have nerves made of steel. That's fine, don't fret over it. It sure was exhilarating. Oh, I hope I don't interrupt anything. All is well, Miss Aslan. Well, I should be going now. That coffee won't brew itself. Thanks, I'll join you shortly. Should I take a picture of the whale? Hello there, knew it! Another grave. Oh, it's a grave with a passcode. Damn it, I'm gonna have to solve a puzzle to mourn. There's something weird about this gravestone. Let's see again. Oh, looks like there's a missing piece. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, that's the wrong button. I'm gonna save. Nothing's killed me so far, but I still like the idea of saving. It makes me feel safe. Hey, can I have the coffee? What perfect timing, dear. I saw you from the window. Coffee is waiting for you on the table. Please, enjoy it, dear. I'm sure I will. Thank you, Miss Aswin. What table? Where? Drink? Oh, right there! What a fantastic aroma. That was good. I'm delighted to hear that, dear. We cultivated the beans ourselves. That is fucking insane. As somebody who worked at multiple coffee shops, that is fucking insane. The the climate, the temperature, the um, humidity that's needed to actually grow good coffee beans, that's fucking crazy. Also, you shouldn't be able to do that. They're one of a kind. Actually, they're kind of dead ghosts, so they can probably do whatever the fuck they want. You know what? Yeah, I'll give it to them. I can tell. That did me good. Thank you, madame. My pleasure, dear. But you still sound so tired. You know what? I'm going to run you a bath. No, uh, no, you don't need to. I insist. It's going to do you wonders. Nothing heals you like warm water. Well, I suppose I could. That's the spirit. Uh, it's spirit, because they're ghosts. I just don't want to trouble you, that's all. If that's what you're worried about, you can help me. I always mix some aromatic herbs with the bathing water. Could you fetch some herbs from the garden? Yeah, of course. Splendid. Bring the herbs to the bathroom once you're ready. Okay, thanks. I'm assuming that this is the garden. <gasps> this hat. God damn it! Still chasing your cap, I take it. Smart ass, eh? <laughs> yep. That's me. I was so close. Cursed be that gust of wind. Who knows where it will take my precious cap next. Yeah, tough luck. I'm so sick of this. I will not deliver a single envelope before I get back my cap. Oh, and I'm gonna have to get his cap back. Are you going on strike, Ben? Yes, exactly. Strike! Okay, gain your composure. I'll see if I can find your cherished cap. I'm on strike, everyone! I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that it's gonna be inside of the... Attic. I'm a fucking genius! I'm gonna get this dude's cap. Yoink. Look what we have here. There's no doubt this is the mailman's cap! <laughs> Hello, sir. <laughs> hey man, guess what? I found your cap. Y you did? Here you go. <laughs> Thank you from the bottom of my heart. That's cool. You may not fully grasp the significance of these deliveries to us ghosts. The letters carry the thoughts and prayers of our loving of our living loved ones. Aw. Huh. I had no idea. Th you're a fucking asshole then for going on strike just because you lost your hat. You're a fucking shitty person. Understandably so. Have you ended your strike by any chance? I have indeed. I got my cap back, so I'm all good to go. Well, in that case, I will not hold you any longer. You're a good person. Thank you. 
You're not a good person, though. Because you're going to go on strike because you lost your fucking hat. Gate is locked. Can I take another picture of it? Oh. Is this going to be the key to the gate? I shouldn't be going through other people's mail. A letter from Miss Eswin? Yeah, that's not for me. Huh? What's this? Storage block? It's... It said strange block, not storage. <sighs> Do I just need to mix them, mix them all about? Mix them all about? Oh, wait. The cross and the triangle- Oh, no! <laughs> the cross and the triangle are furthest away from each other. So, technically, all I really need to do is... There we go! <laughs> I was gonna say, all I really need to do then is just put the X and the triangle on opposite sides and then switch the two in the middle. And if I switch it again and it doesn't work, then that means I just need to switch the X and the triangle again. That's it. There's a hatch beginning to open the tombstone. It's gonna give me a key. What do we have here? A garden key! All right, ma'am, I'm gonna get your aromatic herbs from the garden. Oh, God damn it! There we go. 